Today we will see little more detail about tabs. What is this? Accounts is a tab. So if I want to create a new account, I need to go back to account tab and I need to click a new account, right? Yes or no? Hello? Yes. Yeah. So now here I am getting account name. Let's say account name is Salesforce. My skills is my account name. And parent account, I am saying Salesforce. Let's say Salesforce. Parent account is nothing but a relationship, self relationship. What is this parent account? Self relationship. Whenever you see this icon, means if you seeing, if you are finding this icon, it means that there is a relationship. Instead of filling, you don't want to type anything in this. All you need to click on the relationship icon, which is nothing but a lookup icon. What is this icon name? Lookup icon. Okay. Lookup. It actually does a another record. I mean, it tries to open a record, new tab to select a record. Let's say if I open, if I click, it will open a new tab. Now I am selecting my skills. Automatically it got filled in, right? Account number, let's say account number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Account site 12. What is this type of field? Whenever I am clicking this, what, what kind of field is this? I mean, how generally you will define these type of fields? Anyone? These fields are called pick list field. These fields are called what field? Pick list. Industry is also a pick list. Rating is also a pick list. Let's say phone number is 998697345. Facts I don't have. Let's say website is www. Ownership, public. Billing street, billing state, and whatnot. I just provided some main street. Right. Why it become yellow? Because these are auto fill. Uh, in my system, there is a local history which is just filling out everything. Customer policy, SLA date, gold, maybe, active, yes, number of locations, one, SLA, serial number, one, two, three, four, five. Description, this is a sample account, save. Now, whatever we are seeing a record, right? This is called what record? Account detail, account detail layout. What is this called? Account? Hello? Account detail layout. Account, account detail, layout. detail layout. Please respond it, okay? Account detail layout. So let's say, Observe one thing, here we do not have any sections, right? Just account owner and everything is in the same page. But if I click on edit, you see a sections like account information, address information, additional information, description, right? This something is different from the way what we are seeing here, right? In the detail page. But you will be having all same fields, but the only difference is that the sections is not available, right? This in the edit mode, if you are editing any of your record, then that layout is called edit layout. Then that layout is called edit layout. What layout is that? Edit layout, okay? So I just wanted, now I'm thinking, I wanted to have a new field saying that account nickname. I wanted to have a nickname. Instead of just account name, I need to have a new field now. I wanted to store a new information called account info. Account nickname, how can I do that? So as I said, account is a standard object, right? In standard object, you, will, you are not allowed to create, edit or delete. But we are allowed to customize. What we can able to do, we are allowed to customize. So what customization I will do? Let's say I'm opening my Excel. I'm opening my Excel. What happened? So much of time it is taking this here it is I'm just opening my Excel continue create if today I say yes number name phone rank year 
But today I just entered some random numbers. Okay. Today I, I was capturing only these four details. These four, five details. Tomorrow, my correspondent came or my HOD came. He wanted to have a date of birth. How can I store a date of birth on this? All we will be doing a new field called date of birth, right? New column name, right? Yes or no? Yes. We are not changing anything in the template. We are not changing in the basic template. Basic template remains same. On top of that, we are adding our columns. On top of that, we are adding our columns. The same thing here also. We are keeping all this field as it is, but we will be creating a new column on top of the standard object. How to create a new field? To create any new field, you can have a multiple ways. One way, first, the first way I am showing, go to setup. Because we are building something, so go to build section, customize. We are customizing standard things, so customize and search for an account and select fields. This is one way, either you can go to setup and just put directly to accounts. You will be filtered down. Accounts, fields. Once you have been to account fields, and remember one thing, don't click on accounts. Don't click on, if you click on accounts, you will be having this type of things, right? Again, you need to click. Instead of being, you can always click directly on top of fields, account fields. And scroll down little bit and you will find a section called account custom fields and relationships. You will find a section called account custom fields and relationship. So, the top fields are standard fields, account standard fields where you will not able to modify, where you will not able to modify. But in account custom fields is the fields which we create. Click on new, click on new. So now, will you all agree, whenever you create any new column, we will decide right what type of field is that, whether you are entering a date of birth, date of birth means which data type. Date of birth means which data type? Hello? Okay. So, date of birth, I mean, whenever you are creating a new field, first you need to decide which type of data you are going to store. Whether it is a text field, whether it is a lookup, or whether it is a just a checkbox or like a money, I mean currency field or a date field and all these are the data types available in Salesforce. Now, account nickname is actually a text field. Account nickname is just a text field, right? So, I am choosing a text is my data type. Next, account nickname and nickname length could be like a 15 characters description. This field is created for account nick name. Please, here you have description and help text. Description is for just to know why we created this file. Help text is for a user hint. What is user hint? Let's go back to here. If I go to new, uh, do we have any hint fields here? There is no hint fields at all. My God. Sorry, no fields is available basically. Let's see. Please provide the calling name. So now you have observe always require a value in order to th save this record means if you check this one, what happens? Account name, account nickname is always mandatory. Account nickname is always mandatory. And do not allow duplicates in the sense, if I say my nickname is Lava. If there are some other person who comes in the system, if he also enters saying that Lava, then it will throw error saying that, hey, duplicates are not allowed. You understand? Like unique names. And uh, we'll talk about external ID. Generally, external ID is used to integrate system. We are not discussing anything. I don't want to put in a confusion now. So I'm not making this field is required. I'm going with the next step. We are going with the next step. Now, field level security. Why security comes in place? Let's say 
all we agree that in one organization there are different types of fields right there are different types of users there are different like ceos managers co-workers or labor and what not there are a few information which need to be viewed only by a managers not by a low level people right so for them these are the profiles and each profile have their own users we'll discuss about profile concept but when it comes to the field level security for time being always choose a visible always choose a visible permission next account layout what is layout as we discussed before account detail layout account edit layout right so these are the different layouts available account layout and then just saving out now what i'll do i'll go back to my account salesforce is my account record now you can see account nickname here it is right this is the help text please provide the calling name this is how user will get a instruction till here are we clear hello acknowledge please whether you have yes. any yeah teja clear and okay so another thing as i said there are two ways to create a new field right one way is to going back to setup and going to build customize accounts and then fields the other way is that you have a lookup icon here you here you have a small arrow mark dock icon right click on that this is nothing but a quick access menu what is this menu called quick access menu you are on hover you will set expand quick access menu this is called quick access menu click on quick access menu and click view fields directly it will open up the account fields which our object you are in right if i am in contact object if i click a dock icon are you here if i click a view fields it will open my contact fields so in which of in which tab you are in only those fields will be opened up okay so yeah. another thing now the problem for me is account name is here account name nickname is here is this really looking good account name is here and account nickname is here what is the ideal way account name and followed by a account nickname right so now we'll change the order of fields how to display for that what we need to do what is this called page layout right this is called layout which is nothing but a page layout which is nothing but a page layout so what you'll do go back to setup and as i said customize now this time instead of fields what we need to search for page layouts page layouts right page layouts and choose an account layout don't worry about these four because this is using for other application like marketing sales and support apps but account layout is the one we are using edit layout now you can see edit i mean these icons scroll down you got this information right where is this account name nickname account nickname is here just to hold by clicking and drag wherever you want it i am doing this you got it how to do just like a drag wherever you want green color will highlight i just wanted to place there that's it header is visible only on edit only so if you observe before whenever i click edit that time you got account information basic information right whenever you highlight this one there is a setting symbol on the left side right on your right side there is a setting symbol click on setting symbol and select detail page also setting symbol detail page if i have detail page it only displays in detail if it's checked in edit page it only displays in edit page else it will display in both
Now what I'll do? I'm just saving it. Here is, there is a show button. There is no save. There is no save button. Here you have a save button, right? Click on save. Go back to your accounts. Open Salesforce. You can see a sections now. Account information, address information, additional information, everything, right? Clear? There, guys.